Recent videos have claimed that acupuncture can double your chance for IVF success, but can it really? The shocking answer lies ahead. YouTube videos like this one and other sources have made an unbelievable claim that acupuncture can double your chance for IVF success. That is an amazing claim, especially when you consider that the IVF success rate for a young patient is over 50%. They're essentially saying that they can now guarantee that everybody gets pregnant. First, how is acupuncture supposed to help? The general theory of acupuncture is based on the premise that there are patterns of energy flowing through the body which are essential for health. Disruption of this flow is believed to be responsible for disease. Acupuncture claims to correct imbalances of flow at identifiable points close to the skin. These acupuncture points correspond to specific areas on the surface of the body. Attempts to study these areas found that they do have unique identifiable properties such as temperature and electrical conductance. Next, how is acupuncture supposed to help improve the chances for pregnancy during IVF? Various theories claim that acupuncture may increase blood flow to the ovaries and uterus, cause relaxation of the uterus, or even change the levels of various hormones. Let's assume for a moment that all of those things are true. And by the way, that is a big assumption. The most important question is, Will doing acupuncture make it more likely that you will get pregnant? There have been a few studies that suggested that it might. However, these studies were often very small and had major problems as to how the study was set up and performed. Luckily, acupuncture received so much attention as an add-on to IVF that some really big and really well done studies were performed to look at whether it was really effective or not. One of the best studies ever performed was done in Australia and New Zealand. They studied over 800 couples going through IVF. They split these couples into two groups. The first group received real acupuncture. The first acupuncture treatment was administered after fertility medications were started, but before the egg retrieval, and two treatments were given on the day of embryo transfer. Each acupuncturist had a minimum of two years clinical experience, held membership with a national professional association, and all acupuncturists were trained in the treatment protocol with annual refresher training. The treatment strategy was based on traditional Chinese medicine. Acupuncture points were located in areas related to the uterus and ovaries to stimulate blood flow and in areas located that inhibit stress. Now the second group had their treatments at the same time as the first group and by the same well-trained acupuncturists. This time, however, instead of using real acupuncture needles, they used fake acupuncture needles. These fake needles had a retractable needle shaft and a blunt tip. Also, the acupuncturists were instructed to lightly place the fake needle to the surface of the skin with no manipulation. Plus, just in case this might have still resulted in some effect, the locations chosen were well away from known acupuncture points and with no known function. So, highly trained acupuncturists, multiple treatments, and large numbers of patients. Group one was real and group two was fake. So how did those two groups do? Well, as you might have guessed by now, there was no difference. Both groups had about an 18% chance for pregnancy. Our Infertility TV bottom line, the real acupuncture group didn't do any worse. Acupuncture didn't hurt their chances for getting pregnant, it just didn't improve their chances. So at IVF1, we let patients do acupuncture if they want, but we carefully counsel them that the best scientific data shows that it does not improve their chances for pregnancy. If you do want tips on how to improve your chances for pregnancy with IVF, check out this playlist. But first, give a thumbs up to this video. If you are not a subscriber, then what are you waiting for? Subscribe already. It's like having a fertility specialist on your phone.